Hello Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Welcome and welcome cross watchers. I hope you're all having an amazing day today. I'm going to be taking a look and seeing what manifests for you, what's going on right now in your current situation with you, the person on your mind, if any, and what you need to know. So whenever you do see this, it will be the right time. And as always, take what resonates and leave out the rest. Practice using your own discernment. And don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Follow me on all social media, TikTok, Instagram. I am spiritually goldy on all platforms. And if you're interested in a personal reading done by myself, I will leave all of that information in the description box below for you all with the link to my website, spiritualegoldy.com, for you to take a look at all of the different options for readings. Okay, so foundation and achievements, four of wands, four, four. So it's happening. It's happening. You've put in a lot of work and effort into something and it's coming together. It's certain plans that you had are manifesting for you. I'm seeing a lot of stability. I'm seeing a strong foundation with you and, and another person. You may be going to some sort of gathering. Um, you're com coming together with someone and right now you're kind of unsure about where things are going, where things are headed or what direction you're going in. Things feel kind of unknown to you and it feels like you're kind of fed up. <laughs> you're, I'm not going to lie. It feels like you're kind of fed up with the unknown. You're fed up with like, oh, where I don't even know where I'm going. Like you're walking into the unknown. You're walking into a space that is different, but is going to end up uh, leading you to an achievement. All right. They're saying don't give up. Stand your ground and stand in your power. Okay, stand in your power, take your power back here. Some of you have given your power away to fear, to fear. And they're wanting you to take your power back. Okay, because I'm seeing another four here, four, four, four. You may be seeing a lot of fours. This could be a sign, but fours are about foundations. It's about stability and settling in, settling down. You're going to be settling down or you're reaching a point where you're going to be able to settle down in your life. You're not going to be fighting so hard. Okay. It's like you've been through all the trials, the tribulations, the traumas, but after that time, we go back to a one. You are reaching an end goal of your life that has been it's like the end is in sight here a struggle is coming to its end in your life even if you can't see it right now you've regained stability in your life and there's certain things in your life right now that you are living in, in certain things that you've manifested Take back, take a look back and, and see what those things are. Because I, I, I can see you're at least living one of your manifestations right now. And there's more coming. All right. But yeah, there's a lot of um, kind of insecurities right now. Kind of wants. And it does feel like you're kind of... Maybe feeling a little triggered. Yeah, triggered. Triggered. Annoyed. That things are so unclear. Okay. 
So, Tower Reverse, though, I kind of see this as you rebuilding something new in your life. Right now, you may be making certain offers or investing your time and energy into something new or towards this Queen of Cups. Could be a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. It doesn't have to be. Um, this is someone around you who is really intuitive, really um, em empathetic, compassionate. Tell me about this Queen of Cups. High Priestess. Yeah, didn't I say intuitive? Some sort, Something is being revealed to you. Something is being revealed to you here. And I want to know what that is. <laughs> I want to know what that is. What is being revealed? King of Cups. Okay. Oh. We have the Queen and the King of Cups here. High Priestess, the number two. Four of Wands. There could be like a twin flame union or soulmate entering your life. This in some way may give you clarity. Queen of Cups, this may be someone who you come across. Someone you come across someone you have a conversation with that ends up giving you some sort of like clarity. Okay. There's a fulfillment, a wish fulfillment. Prayer or wish being granted. If you do have someone on your mind right now, think of them and let's take a look and see what their energy is saying. How are they feeling right now at this moment? All right. I can tell you not doing so well. Five of Pentacles does look like this person may be feeling like they're lacking in some way. Maybe even feeling left out in the cold. Financially could even be struggling. Feeling like things are not looking so good right now. Maybe between the both of you. Okay. And they're seeing you as six of pentacles. I feel like you're supporting this person though. They see you as um, supporting them or, or giving to them in some way. Um, but I'm getting just a lot of like insecurities from this person where they may not feel enough or what they're doing is enough or something just not being enough. Hmm. The fool has the actions that they want to take towards you this month. Looks like they are wanting to take a risk or even travel towards you. Three of Swords, though, is... Yeah, this is person is hurting or heartbroken over something right now. And they're seeing you as giving them some sort of support here. And they feel like it's a risk to take... But they want to take that risk anyways. And they're about to make a decision. They're about to make a decision about, about this. Clarify this Three of Swords though. Oh, Ten of Swords. Hmm. All right. So... It's interesting. I see that 
I see this person wanting to take a risk towards you, but then it also looks like they are making a decision that kind of hurts them. I'm picking up on like self-sabotage. Self-sabotage. This person may withdraw towards the end of the month. Um, it's like they take a risk and then and then I, I see them withdrawing. Okay. But there's still hope with this four of wands here. Something is coming together. Queen of Wands, Fire Sign, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius here. Something is a sure thing. Something is like a sure thing coming together. Um, but you're really going to have to stand your ground on this one. Standing your ground. Look. Okay, standing your ground when it comes to truth and taking action towards towards what you've been walking towards. It's like you're already on track. I'm hearing you're already on this track. You're already in the right direction. It's a matter of staying strong, spiritual strength, power, and standing your ground here. Um, not letting, not letting certain obstacles or situations like get in your way of this. Hearing home, homecoming, homecoming. What else does Pisces need to know right now? wisdom you're gonna gain a lot of wisdom victory success you you're going to you're you have a victory in success you're gonna feel validated in some way even if things are a little bit confusing right now all right stubborn 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 energy but it's at it's almost to its end nearly there i'm seeing the number seven nine four nine eight five eighteen ten those numbers they could be related to birthdays special days synchronicities so the letters s y g f w a s and p those letters could be in your name or someone else's name but with that said, this is what I'm seeing. If it did resonate, let me know. And if you made it this far in the video, thank you so much for watching. I hope that you all have an amazing and blessed rest of your day. Bye.